Bronx. Pookie is he seven here with a little update. And today is October the 14th, 2010. The final fight has not yet has not yet arrived just just yet, but I think it will. A little bit of what's been going on during the LPs. I've been I've been pretty busy with the Shatastic games and whatnot. And uh, I do plan on going back to finishing Frankenstein and fortunately get a jump on Godzilla. As soon as I figure out the proper path to go with all this. Let's see, a few things, a few things I need to point out. A few things I need to point out is that I've been going through, a, I mean, I've been pretty busy. So, you know, I I don't know what I'll have for a let's play, uh, a weekend let's plays. I might have something totally unexpected. I don't know for, I don't know what I'll be having, but I know I'll have something. Okay, about the November, about the November um, LPs. Since November is the month of the ninja, we call it a ninja November, that's the thing. What I have already down is Shinobi the Arcade. I'll probably do an NES run too, just in case. I already. I also have um, the Ninja Warriors. I'll probably do another run of it, but this time with commentary. Uh, let's see. What else am I going to have? If I am going to do another game, if I am going to do something else, I'll probably do Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the arcade, and Turtles in Time, its sequel. I'm not sure if I will do the NES version because let me tell you, I was in the middle of a, I was in the middle of doing a let's play of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles the arcade, but all of a sudden like, yeah, short fuse and and all of a sudden whatever I was working on got totally wiped out. So therefore, I'm not sure if I will do that again. But I know I already have Wrath of the Black Mana down, Chanel before the arcade down, and, I'll, and what I will probably do, what I will probably do is the NES version, like I said, and I'll probably do Shadow Dancer. I don't know. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. Another thing you need to be aware of is that um, I will also do. Legend of the Mystical Ninja, as well as the um, original version, Gambare Goemon, or Mr. Goemon, and um, I probably have something else planned, but I can't say what it is right now. It, it's still under wraps, and I'm still, and I'm still basically trying to work through it. So yeah, it's kind of funny. But rest assured, you'll enjoy it, nonetheless. I certainly hope you've been enjoying shit-tastic games, because you think this installment is you think this installment is crazy. Oh, there's there's gonna be more. Rest assured, there's plenty of games out there just waiting, just waiting, just to be plucked. And to be ridiculed, just like the dogs that they are. So, yeah. Tell your friends, tell your neighbors. Shitty games are coming, and you better run, because they'll be like attacking the killer tomatoes around here. Or would that be killer clowns from outer space? Anyway. I digress. Liddy, I digress. Um, let's see. There's not much else I can say after the ninja, after the 
Ninja November. Except that I will be going back to Sailor Moon and I will eventually finish the whole, just finish the rest of September off. And I'm doing this during, I'm doing this during the month of October. I'm going to finish the rest of Sailor Moon off and basically just finish the game probably this weekend and most likely and most likely that'll lead me to doing the um the video um the video reports of the following the anime the musical and the live action sh series i will do those i will do those three series by most likely in subdivision, like I'll like I'll do Sailor Moon, Sailor Moon to Super S, and Sailor Stars, you know, totally separate. And then of course I'll do the movies, and then and then I'll jump to the um, musicals, and then finally I'll talk about the. Um, talk about the live action. So, you know, there's probably other, um, there's probably other, um, areas I'll talk, I'll, I'll speak about, but, um, you're just gonna have to wait for that. Another thing I want to point out is that in November, there's gonna be a rally held outside, uh, outside the Supreme Court. And while this is going on, this is during that this is during the case in which the ECA is going up against Schwarzenegger to keep our um, games free. We don't want them to be banned or restricted because what they don't know is that we personally make up like a good amount of, a good amount of the world, a good amount of like maybe. 70, if not 80 percent of the population were gamers. Because, like I said, there are more people who are into video gaming that lets on, and you know, it, it's time that we, we, as a community, need to stand up. So, on November 2nd, if you are in the Washington area. Go to the rally. Make your voice be known and heard. I will be on the, I will be across the um, interwebs doing my thing. But really, what you need to do, what you need to do right now, you need to basically show your support. Defend your video honor. Defend your, defend your rights as a gamer. Speak out. You know, don't let, don't let, out, out of all things, do not let one man like Schwarzenegger try to take our livelihood away from us. Because that would really, really suck. So, you know, me personally, on that day, on that day, November second, mark down your calendars. On that day, I will be on the I will be on the um, on YouTube. Most likely making a most likely making a a rant or a, or a speech of some sort about what's been going on and the importance of us being video gamers and whatnot. But to my friends, to my subscribers, lurkers, anyone who is listening or watching or checking out my um, channel rate comment subscribe you know show me a little love leave me comments in, in my um in my channel or or my many videos i check out i check them out daily so you know please show me some love and support I just want to let you guys know that, you know, 
we gotta stand up. In November, let's all stand up for our rights. Whether you're a gamer, enthusiast, master, speedrunner, whatever you are, let's players, gamers unite, all right? That's what we need to do. We need to unite. On that day, let's all unite. You know, make a video response. Make a video, make a video response on this day, you know, on, on November the 2nd. Make a video response and let your voice be known. Whether you're going to show your face or not, the point is you have to make yourself be known. Make yourself count. So really, do what you can. And the best thing you can do is voice out your opinion. Voice out your heart. Say what you, want, or say what you need to say. Because it's very important to let the world know that you are a gamer. And you are proud of who you are. Because I'm going to let you know right now. I'm not just Pookie Izzy 7, the underdog of the underrated. But I am also a geek, a nerd, a dweeb. If I had glasses, I'd be called glasses. But apparently I don't. I do wear glasses though. Anyway, the dragon road is burning, folks. We need to start riding on that dragon road. And on top of that, yeah, I'm also an intellectual as well as a gamer. So personally, yeah, I'm proud of who I am. And if something is wrong with that, then something is wrong with you. So with that, there ain't much to say. Except that if you like what you what you heard, comment, rate, and and even subscribe to me if you like what you're hearing. I also take requests. Whatever you want to do, you know. You want to send me some music, fine. That's great. That's awesome. I'm an avid music collector. If there's a game you want to send me, I'll check it out. See, see how it works. And, you know. I can only do so much, but, you know. I'm out there for the gamers, man. I'm out there because I'm a gamer. And I'm spearheading the battlefield. So with that, I think that'll be the end of this report. Because I have somehow run out of things to say and my time is almost up. So with that, I have to say, This has been the Let's Play report of um, October. That's going to November. And eventually, December, I don't know what's going to happen. Mostly, I'm going to leave that up to you guys. So, with that, you know. So, with that. To my peoples, to my loved ones, to my friends, colleagues, you know who you are, because you know who I am. I am proudly to be called Pookie Izzy 7, the underdog of the underrated. And I will always continue to do what I've been doing. Continue to be the underdog. And with that, the underdog has spoken. And I am out!